welcome to Florescene. Hello and welcome to the Florescene Show, Season 1, Episode 13. I'm your host, Dr. Alan Glazer. Don't forget to hit that red subscribe button below so you get notified on future shows and segments. This week in ODs on Facebook, we've got eyelashes. A member posted this meme and says, I'll tell women when in the slit lamp that they've got good lash game. Well, we've all seen this trend inside and outside of clinic. It's, well, not so subtle. Seriously, you could mistake some of these fake eyelashes for Alaskan King Crab Legs. At home, God forbid someone leaves one lying around. I can't tell you how many times I went to get a bug swatter and was about to smack that thing before I realized it was an eyelash. In clinic, they can present a few challenges like direct ophthalmoscopy, INR, and several others. Saw one lady whose lashes were so asymmetrical, I thought she was, came in for a stroke. Other than being good for batting away COVID virus and cheek umbrellas, they present a conundrum behind the slit lamp. Not to mention what they can do to vision. Our community loves a great one or two discussion, don't we? We love it so much that we continue to discuss it on Odie's on Facebook even after we leave work. Well, a doc this week posts about a one or two game he played with a patient when he said, which is better, one or two? And the patient says, TCVECL. Doc says, you don't have to read it, just tell me which is better, one or two, and the patient reads it again. Well, you know what happens now. The doc either put his head down on his desk, did the eternal face palm, or one of several reactions that range from disgust to disbelief and in between. What we don't do, but what we want to do, is slam that phoropter into their face repeatedly. Other people, one or two answers. Doc, which is better? One or two, patient, no. Doc, no is not an option. Or they might say, which is better? Four or five, to which we all know the response is likely, number two is better than any of them. Can I see that one again? Or the I can't tell what they are, I just can't read them. Or, well, one was brighter, but blurrier, and two made the letters look like they had curvy edges. Or the doc says, better one, and the patient jumps in one. <laughs> to which you bite your lip and answer, sweet as pudding pie, wait till I show you two. Or the patient who whips out the 2015 line, throws in an unnecessary information, but it's blurry, and doesn't buy your explanation, it's okay if it's blurry because it's so small, yet they insist on having you do the test again. Ugh, ain't got time for that. A member asks for the best optometry-themed rock band. And we got some great ones like Blind Leopard, the Cyclopenolates, the Macular Degenerates, the Scleral Spurs, Rolling Cones, Accommodative Rock, Band Keratopathy, the Ciliary Body Band, good one, Billy Eyelash, Fleetwood Macula, and the Dendrites, who are likely to go viral, by the way. Good stuff. Well, that's all. And this week for Odie's on Facebook. We can...